is going on everybody Anthony here from playthrough live coming at you with another let's talk a segment of our show where we go over game reviews unboxings discussions tech videos all that stuff and today we are unboxing the Nintendo switch it finally came the NX is finally here we have it I also have the Legend of Zelda that was also the only game I got so just a quick video, I, I want to unbox this. Dan, my friend Dan, our other Playthrough Live host, was supposed to be doing this video, but he got messed up with his camera and it didn't film, and I was the only one, of course, the last minute I, I got the Switch last out of all, all three of us, Dan and Jeff. So now I got stuck doing it. Not that I, I didn't mind that, but I, I, was, I got this yesterday, so I, I really wanted to open it so bad. So the box, beautiful, look at that. Oh man, the label, I mean, you've probably seen enough of that already. This is the side of it. I think it's actually really, uh, really cool. Hopefully my mic's not going in and out, because I got the microphone in front of me, and it's not really, uh, the more I move around, the more it gets messed up. But that's the back of it. Or is that the front? Oh, I'm sorry, this is the front. <laughs> this is the front of the package. Looks beautiful. Then we got the other side here. Got a nice little outdoorsy type of thing where people are bringing this outside. Which I, I hopefully we'll see. Maybe it'll be like a Pokemon Go kind of thing. On the back, it, it shows a bunch of stuff. You know, just your typical warnings on it. And over here, it shows exactly if it focuses. Shows what is included in the box. So you get the gamepad, you get your Joy-Cons, a couple of wrist straps, HDMI cable, the dock, the Pro Controller. What is that? The grip thing. What is it called? Joy-Con grip. That's a nice name. And then the Nintendo AC adapter switch. So, without further ado, let us open it up. I also have Zelda here, but we'll, we'll get to it that later. Oh, what is all this? I'm trying to like stay in front of the mic, but yet be in frame. So I can't even, I can barely see the box because of my setup, because this is the most ghetto thing ever. Plug it in. Set it up. Wow. It's so cool. Let, let's get to the, the main attraction here first. Oh, this is actually kind of tinier than I, I anticipated it being. It feels like an iPhone 6 uh, Plus or something like that, you know what I'm saying? Let's, let's, uh, let's just break it open. Let's put our fingerprints all over it and, and see what she does. Look at the glare on that. I think it's glare proof, actually. Nice glass. How's it feel? I don't want to touch it. I don't want to ruin it. Oh, it's smoother than a baby's bottom. Get a little, I guess that's the USB-C port. Uh, I don't know if it's charged. Well, I, I would assume it probably is. Bunch of screws here. This is actually really a interesting take on this. The back of it. Oh, the almost dropped it. Nintendo Switch certified by Nintendo. Uh, I think this is the kickstand for it. I'm not sure how far it, it bends, so I'm not gonna test that now. What is that? Oh, micro SD card. That's uh, wow. Okay. All right, I guess that's the that's the game slot then. Oh no, the game the game card is up here. This is the game card right here. If I can open it, it's very hard to maneuver this and work a camera at the same time. All right, so that's where the games go. The games are smaller than I expected too. Headphone jack. Uh, I'm assuming these are the speakers here. Volume buttons over here. Got a power button. And I well these the the endpoints this is where the the joy cons are gonna be uh, sliding in. I'm not sure what the I guess you can put an external memory in there I, I think I haven't you think I would do my research in what I'm opening up before I actually open it. But no if I can bust these bitches open. Oh little a uh, little heavier than I expected. It's clearly not not hollow. <laughs> Why would it be? There's a lot of uh, stuff in here actually. You know, it's amazing. I was looking these up on Amazon before from Nintendo. These are these go for $80. Could you believe it? There's a lot of stuff in here. I mean, there's the accelerometers, each individual motion control kind of thing. You got the infrared signal on the right one. But they're basically the same, just uh, reversed kind of thing. Uh, you got your plus buttons here, your minus buttons. The analogs feel pretty good. I can't wait to use them in like... Like beat the crap out of someone, and then I don't know what this this button right here is. Not sure. Haven't been able to play it. I'm sure my co-hosts know what it is. Thanks, guys. These are pretty uh pretty cool. You get triggers here. Let's see how they slide in. All right, I'm gonna do one at a time so I don't drop anything. 
this is the right side, right? Is this this facing the right way? And just like that, like in the Switch commercials, pops right in. This is cool. This looks like a PSP. Not that they were trying to go for that look, but... Oh, I like this. Oh, I'm digging this. Can we get a, an in-screen... Oh, it turned on! What's the main menu look like? Where's the volume? It's all the way up. Wow, this is really nice. Nice digital. Did you hear it? Inglese! Oh. I'm actually going to save the setup for later for when I do it myself. But we're, we'll be doing a discussion video of this next week, me and my co-host. So we'll, we'll get into all the fine details of that. But I'm very impressed with that. That looks pretty cool right now. So we'll put that to the side and see what else we got going on here. Love the packaging. Great packaging. I always appreciate nice packaging. There's nothing in here. I'm afraid I'm going to throw something out. Then again, I have to put it all back in the box anyway. and Because I'm filming off location from the studio. Oh, another HDMI cable! You can never have too many HDMI cables, people. I'm telling you. Never. I'm looking for the actual dock itself, which I believe is... No, that's that's not. Where the hell is the dock? This is uh, this is the remote. I believe they make a rechargeable one. The same basic same thing, but it's got this is a battery for the the rechargeable one. But let's uh, focus on this one while we're at it. This is uh, well well before I do that, we have to undock these and uh, there's buttons here, on the side, and that should slide help it slide right out. You press that, and they actually slide out really easily. So that's that's a nice feature. I have to burp. That'd be really professional. And then just slide them back. How the hell does that happen? Uh-oh. Don't break it, Slappy. Oh, there it goes. All right, so there. Well, that's all in. Uh, I'm not sure. Oh, okay. You see the blinking lights, too, on that. That's pretty cool. I'm not sure how the, the remotes charge. I guess it's through this. Or the actual switch itself, like the the game, the screen thing. I'm not. I don't know. I don't see any plugs on these. I mean that that's pretty cool. A little awkward, I guess. Like when it when it's like really tight, you can't see. But I was like pushing my chest, my nipples together. I don't know why, but I was trying to elaborate how tight it was. Anyway, we've also got in the box. This is the USB-C adapter, but it's an AC adapter too. So it's weird. AC, blah. USB-C plug. An adapter. I'm not going to open that up, but you get the point there. Where the hell is this dock? Nintendo Switch. Health and safety information. So this basically goes in the garbage, because you don't need it. The moment I've been waiting for. The dock. Alright, the packaging is very nice. But... Come on! How does it? Oh, it opens up like that. Wait, what's that? That's how you you plug it in. That's so weird. What is the hell? Is, what, is, what is the point of that? HDMI. How does it all come out? Oh, okay. All right. Cause you see, there's you got some plugs here. If you can see on the inside, AC adapter, USB, HDMI. But then you've also got the USB on the side. I don't. It's, it's, it's kind of weird to me how they why why they did that. So I guess it's, it's going to be a clean setup and you just plug directly into that. So this is basically how it's going to sit. And it's actually a lot tinier than I thought. Am I doing it in the right direction? I sure hope so. I think that's in. Right? <laughs> is it in? Seems sturdy. Oh god, don't drop it. But yeah, guys, that's, uh, that's pretty much it. I mean, it's pretty cool. We're gonna do a full discussion of this. I know this is kind of a rushed video, but I just, I was so excited. I wanted to get the, to get this video out. While I'm at it, I might as well show you the Legend of Zelda, at least what the cartridges look like. So there's nothing, there's, I was disappointed to open up the case and have like nothing, there's nothing, literally nothing. But this is how tiny the, uh, the game cartridges are. Well, let's just demonstrate how it would go into the game. All right, just lift the slot and Hopefully I push it in the right way. I'm assuming that the label is going to face me. Otherwise, I'm just going to jam it in here and be very disappointed. Alright, yeah, so then it's just like a DS kind of thing. Why is it turned on again? 
Very nice. Also, if you were wondering, the, the cartridges do taste like bleach. They taste horrible, that's so you don't eat them to, for small children. Of course, I had a curious mind, I had to try it out for myself. But yeah, guys, I mean, this is the Switch. This is basically the Wii U's prototype. Well, I guess the Wii U was the prototype to this, and they kind of messed that up. But you get the idea. You get your game, basic gamepad, and then on the go, and, and the actual dock for the, your TV. So, I believe the screen is a 720p. I might, I, I'm pretty sure. And then the regular is just 1080p. Uh, depending on the game, I'm not. I don't have the battery life offhand. I think it varies from like, a, at least for the gamepad, it's like two to six hours. I think. I would imagine the dock is unlimited power unless you lose power at home. All right, guys. So that is the Nintendo Switch unboxing, all in its entirety. We're gonna go over the, a lot of the, the you know features and details within the actual uh, interface and everything when our we do our discussion with all three of my co-hosts, and that'll be exciting because you get boring just just talking to yourself about stuff. So if you like this video, give us a thumbs up. If you hate it, that's a huge thumb. If you hate it, give it a thumbs down or a thumb to the side. I can't really, I can't, I don't bend that way because my tripod's right there. Subscribe to us on YouTube for more Let's Talk videos and Let's Plays. Follow and like us on Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, at Playthrough Live. Show your support to Nintendo. Go out and buy a Switch. Ah, I can't wait to plug it in. Until next time, we'll see you in the next one. Take care.